Hi, Mo Pre, Giandra from Black Sports Online. Nice to meet Black Sports Online. Okay. Nice to meet you. Um, so tonight we are out here at the Unsolved the Murders of Tupac and the Notorious B.I.G. Tupac was your brother. Before we talk about the show tonight and before it airs, what is there a story you can share with us or a memory of Tupac that people might not know about him? Um, you know, it's not a story, but just going through this process um, with them helping them uh, consulting on this, you know, I, I, I'm, I, I got to relive things that I forgot about. And, you know, I, I almost forgot that I was with Pac and Big at the garden when they were at the garden. I forgot I, I, I forgot I was even on stage with them, but it's like, you know, it was a whirlwind. The 90s, wow. So, yeah, we were the voice of that generation. So, you know, it, it, it was a lot of events that went, un, uh, went down. In recent years, we've seen a resurgence. You know, Biggie and Pac are always legends in the game and are never far from the conversation. When you consult on projects like this, does it reopen fresh wounds and make you a little sad? Are you happy that a story still being told? How do you feel when these type of projects come about? I am, I, well, I knew that we were going to be legends. Pac knew we were, he was going to be a legend. We knew we were on a legendary track back then. So with that, dealing with post-Pac, you know, post the legend, but it's not really post because he's still alive. So therefore, you know, I'm trying to look out for my brother and his legacy and his memory as usual. Um, it is difficult. Everybody can do it, but I know I had to develop a thick skin in order to, you know, deal with our life in entertainment and the circumstances that we uh, are here, you know. So I think that Pac would want to be uh, uh, um, remembered. I think he would want justice. I think he would want people to still be talking about him. So it all falls into the vein of what he would want. Now, he may not have approved of these these, <laughs> uh, these police and, you know, being able to do their stories before I got to do mine or anybody in the family got to do theirs, but, and however, this is life, this is what we, these are the circumstances and we're going to handle it the best way possible. So we're going to try to make this. I tried to make this the best project I could. Question: You've been so one exposed to a wealth of music and knowledge. Top three songs of your brother, if you could pick three. Top three. Uh, uh, California Love. Um. 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 Uh, I got so many, man. This is unfair. This is just so unfair. Uh, straight balling, cr cradle to the grave. Thank you so much for stopping. You're welcome.